fast. They will be um, good at cornering. They will have a special feel and it will be completely different than any other car you can see on the road. The new GTO has more power, has, is, is faster than anything we've ever built before and that's uh, represented in the design. The design is more muscular, more powerful. Uh, the whole car will go faster. Freestanding wheel concept of Donka Ford is something that nobody does anymore. So it's, it's the most interesting thing to do. If you do a, a normal saloon or a, if you work at a, 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 a normal car manufacturer, you get to draw all these cars that are, you see many of them, but at Donka Ford, nobody sees that. So it makes it more special to work for such a company. And when I, when I was a kid, my father, my grandfather told me about uh, the races he drove in, in, in Spain and, and uh, that area. Um, he showed me pictures and those were the cars that had the pre-standing wheels, those race cars. So it's always been part of my, my images in my head uh, that I had about cars. Today is a very special day because uh, today uh, probably our GTO will, will be born uh, actually so the engine will be started for the first time and uh, we have two guests uh, in our middle uh, from Audi, two uh, electronic ex experts and uh, they are going to, well, they are going to uh, start the engine later today. Sit down and um, design the new the new Donker Ford, uh, which has to be of course tied to the, the past, to the GT, to the D8, but it has to show out uh, a new path for Donker Ford. So um, and it was a very difficult design to do the, the GTO because um, you want to take these elements of the GT but make it more powerful because the engine in the in the GTO is, is larger, it has more horsepower, the car goes faster. So you want to show those muscles in the design without uh, losing the past, the heritage, the, the dawn or DNA. There are a lot of people who, are, who have a very big passion for cars, and especially you and lady stuff. We have a whole team of these guys, but at the same time, not only do they have passion, but they also have knowledge about the car, and that's the way how we do it. to be a big step forward in comparison to the 270 RS or the GT. If you look at the car right now, then you see of course that we saved a lot of weight. We saved a lot of weight in the body and chassis, and at the same time we made the whole body chassis a lot stiffer. The torsional stiffen uh, stiffness has increased a lot, the plastic safety has increased a lot, and with that, of course, the total driving experience. So it's much more responsive, it's much more precise, it's much nicer to drive with. And of course, what we mentioned already, there's also a very nice engine in it, which goes very well with this new high-tech chassis body.
There it is, an NBA GTO, ladies and gentlemen. And behind the wheel, Denis Dolkevoort. Denis, it's gorgeous. <laughs> it's really wonderful. It, it's an actual, it's a, it's a, it's a real Dolkevoort, eh? It's a real Dolkevoort, again, yeah. But a little bit different, I think. Yeah. It's far bigger. It's far bigger. It's uh, way faster, but still a Dolkevoort. But you can't compare it with, uh, with all the other Dolkevoorts. Um, I think uh, what, nice, uh, what a nice thing, nice thing to tell us is that we had uh, a lot of test kilometers the past few months. And then you discover the, the characteristics of the engine, of the torque, and then with the horsepower. But what was very important for us is that we didn't want to have an undrivable car. And with so many horsepowers, that was, of, of course, one of the risks. Is it not scary to drive? It's very scary to drive, <laughs> but um, it's easy to handle. Thanks to the, the air intake system that we created, we don't have any turbo gap. Um, so the car, the engine, is very predictable. And that, in combination with the, the wider body, with the wider uh, uh, suspension, yeah, it's actually uh, an easy car to drive. Hey, and how does it compare to the, the uh, 270 RS? Is it totally different? It's totally different, yeah. yeah. He has some, uh, some, uh, some facts of the GT um, with, with the suspension, for example. But then um, the power is so tremendous that you, the first, the first time that I was uh, on the track with the car and I opened up the throttle, I was just laughing and I was just thinking this is this is something that the people will like and that we can uh, yeah uh, win some races with uh, for sure. It looks really wonderful. Denise, thank you. Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, this is it, the DHGTO. And I would like to invite you to have some drinks, enjoy the, the moment and touch the car. Talk to the Dockerford people now so you can all see and feel what the actual DHGTO looks like. And one more thing, if you drive home, drive home fast but safely. Thank you very much. Enjoy.